Long and Short Vowel Sounds from the Axelson Academy. According to Reading Foundation Standard 3B, kindergarten students learn to associate long and short sounds with common spellings for the five major vowels. The following three activities may help students as they practice this skill. The first activity is the use of vowel signs. Students are given two small, picket-like signs, each with a vowel on them. You say a word, and the child holds up the sign with the vowel that matches the sound in the word you just said. Begin with just two vowels from which to choose. Eventually, students should be able to hear the word you state and select the correct vowel they heard in that word from all five options. Begin with short vowel sounds, move to long vowel sounds, and then mix the two. Having students write the vowel on a small whiteboard and hold it up also works, but it is more time consuming as kindergartners may take a while to record their answer. Another activity that allows students to practice vowel identification uses a strip of paper or cardstock with the vowels printed on it and a clothespin. The teacher says a word or shows a picture, fish, and the student clips their clothespin under the vowel in that word, b. Finally, you can use a categorization or sorting activity around the vowels heard in spoken words. Students can take either the pictures of the words or small objects representing the words and sort them into containers with the vowels labeled on them. Begin with just two containers and have students sort the objects or pictures appropriately. As students gain understanding of this activity, you can increase the number of containers and the number of vowels that students are working with. This has been Long and Short Vowel Sounds from the Axelson Academy.